How would you like to have someone go over your credit card bill each month so you wouldn't have to do it? That's not nice. 700 says Michael Finney is here to say mm -hmm. there is a service that you need to know about. Yeah, we all say we check our credit yeah. card. You tell yeah. us all the time. Yeah, no. yeah, yeah but what again. we all mainly do is scan it. And if there's no glaring error, well, we feel pretty good about it. Well, now there's a new service that will check your bills for you. A computer does the work and you profit from it. They picked it up. And I went Thomas McLeod accidentally left his credit card at a toy store, and it was picked up by a thief. And someone had purchased over five hundred dollars worth of fresh seafood <laughs> <laughs> down at the uh, at the at the market on my credit card. Now he got the charges reversed, but the incident got him thinking about security. This is a, this is blatant fraud. This is something that's going on with with me losing it. But maybe there's other things I'm missing and other stuff that's going on. So that was about three months ago. He started paying closer attention, and that led him to BillGuard.com, a unique news service that works at keeping your bills free from overcharges. BillGuard is uh, the world's first bill monitoring service that is capable of actually checking your bill for you and finding um, things such as hidden fees and billing errors that are very hard for you to find, um, as well as fraud that your bank has missed. BillGuard does that by looking for complaints on the Internet, going to the BBB, Twitter, complaint boards, anywhere, then applying those complaints and concerns to your specific bill. A lot of unstructured data all over the web that we've built technology that can actually turn that data into actionable knowledge that is used by our system to then scan your credit card and debit card bill and identify charges on your bill that have been complained about by others on theirs. That collective knowledge and Bill Guard's insider information has helped Thomas. So far, Bill Guard found a reoccurring charge of 12 bucks a month that he canceled and $40 in overcharges from his bank. Yeah. Is it the money or the joy of not paying that money that you like? It's a combination of both. 40 bucks is money that I like to have in my pocket that I could use to buy more toys. And, and uh, you know, it's the joy of sort of figuring out that there's something going on that I didn't know about. And for now, anyway, the service is free. In the future, phone bills will also be monitored, and eventually, with a premium service that you have to pay for, you only have to complain about the overcharges. Bill Guard will take care of that, too. Mm. Well, that's It'll all pretty find... attractive. It is nice. All right. Sounds like a deal. Thanks, <laughs> Thanks Michael. Michael.